Hey guys, Joe the Other Guy here to give you some quick detailing tips using these tools. Okay, so these are some very simple non-detailing products, but they actually work great to de detail your car. They're a soft bristle brush. I got a two inch, a one inch, and a half inch bristle brush along with two one inch foam brushes. And I found these easily at the hardware store. Much under five bucks, I got these five tools. And the reason I actually decided to do this in the Grand Am, there's all these little intricate spots, like underneath right there, you can't really get your finger in there or anything. And this is where these things come into play greatly. So, you can see right now that this is gross. This is just, not to my liking whatsoever. So, I actually have some spray interior cleaner. This one is Carbrite, but you can use uh, other cleaners and degreasers available to you. This one is just a bio enzymatic interior cleaner, which means it gets rid of bacteria as well. So, what I'm gonna do is uh, heavily spray the interior. I'm also going to kind of spray the cluster down. I also do have a microfiber and a terry towel with me. So, the first thing is I'm going to use this one inch or half inch brush and just get those really small intricate areas around the shift boot. Now, you're just going to kind of hit everywhere. You're obviously not going to you know, see what you're doing end product until you're done but and get the boot but just do those intricate errors with the little half brush you can see the dirt lifting up out of the foam right now Now with that done, we're just going to move over to this uh, two inch brush and just kind of fan out the rest of it. Now again, I'm not using a lot of effort. I'm just uh, brushing it in. Each brush, we get into these dirty cup holders and uh, we're kind of not fitting in there. So we're going to go back to the little half inch brush. Okay, so now we're gonna take the terry towel and just do a quick wipe of everything. So this is where the foam pieces come into play. You can kind of see that there's still some cleaner and debris in those spots. Just kind of mash your, your foam piece in there as much as you can. And it really bites right into those places. There's all these places that you really couldn't get your finger can now be reached. Like even that spot, all these little buttons underneath these 
these buttons you can just get right in there with your foam brush and also like a quick spot like this you're just able to get in there inside your vent housings So you can literally go from this soapy mess and disgusting interior to a nice professionally detailed final product using these very simple, cheap, effective tools. Hey, I'm Joe the Other Guy. Thanks for watching this video. Hope it helped you. Please like and subscribe. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus, and my email's down below.